This is your KCTV 5 News Update. Breaking overnight, the Miami County Sheriff's Office confirms someone has drowned at Hillsdale Lake. Emergency personnel were sent to the Marysville bo boat ramp uh, right after 530 yesterday afternoon. A witness said a person fell off of a boat while trying to tie off and didn't come back up. Searchers ended the search around 930 last night and will continue this morning. The boat ramp and surrounding water is currently closed to the public until further notice. Also breaking overnight, Raytown police currently investigating a shooting right near East 67th Street in Raytown Road. Officers found one female shot. She was transported to the hospital. It's not clear what her condition is this morning. We're working to find that out. There's also no information yet on a suspect. Do you think the J.C. Nichols Fountain should be renamed? You have a chance to tell Kansas City Parks and Recreation leaders about it today. The second meeting to discuss it happens at 2 at the Bruce R. Watkins Heritage Center. Nichols was a real estate developer who helped establish the Country Club Plaza. Historians say he's responsible for implementing policies that kept black people confined to certain parts of the city. Good Wednesday morning to you, Kansas City. We are waking up to a whole lot of sunshine across our area this morning with just a few clouds working their way across our downtown skyline. And that's what I expect for today. Overall, the majority of us, it's a dry run from now through the time you head to bed and temperatures just a couple of degrees warmer than yesterday. We will likely be in the lower 80s by the lunch hour, topping out near 85 degrees this afternoon. We'll be a little warmer today, but not nearly as hot and humid as we saw last week. I think the hot stuff and the more humid Humid stuff moves in by tomorrow. Now, the newest updates of your storm track by forecast track. Again, the majority of us dry, but an isolated storm of potential on the west side of town as we're heading towards tonight. We have a 20% chance of rain this evening, a 30% chance of showers first thing tomorrow morning. I think we'll see better chances for showers and thunderstorms. Some of these could be on the stronger side as we're heading towards the end of the work week and looking ahead to the weekend. Have a great day. Turn to KCTV 5 News for the latest all day. This is your personalized update because KCTV 5 News stands for you.